Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Rest week is happening right now and it is fantastic. Uh, a couple of things about rest week. Some people call it rest week. I like to call it like adaptation week. My coach calls it adaptation week. It's super catchy, it makes total sense. This week is about adapting to the last three weeks of workouts. That's what's going on. Anyways, um, lots of cool things happening. Uh, today we have a two hour ride planned, but before we dive into that, do breakfast. Let's talk about breakfast. Uh, today I'm making pancakes again. Uh, as you saw in my last one, I went back to my old school uh, blueberry walnut pancakes. But today I'm trying a new recipe. It's basically the same base, but instead of walnuts and blueberries, you switch in vanilla and banana. So they're banana pancakes. You can also put some pecans on there if you want. Anyways, uh, that's what I'm going with this morning. I think it's gonna be super good. Let's make those. So it's adaptation week. Technically rest week is another name for it. It's most commonly known for, but my coach calls it adaptation week. I absolutely love that. It makes way more sense. So Monday, Tuesday was completely off the bike. No riding, just relaxing. Catching up on any food, nutrition. It's kind of rolling out, letting the muscles relax, all the good things. Today, Ride plan is two hours, unstructured. Just go ride, have fun, uh, don't breathe too hard, just endurance. Pretty much it. Not a whole lot more to say about that. So when I ended my three week block, I think my CTL or my fitness got up to 111. So it's actually pretty good. It's on track. Actually, it's a little bit ahead of uh, the plan we have. And then my fatigue was like negative 35, which is to be expected. You know, we kind of slowly built up to putting me into that deep of a hole. But as of today, my fitness obviously has dropped because the two days completely off the bike. It's down to about 104 and my fatigue is negative five. So by the end of this week, I think I'll build my fitness back up to about 108 and my fatigue or my form will actually be trending positive. I believe it should be around positive five. And then we start a new three week cycle. The other thing about this week is I have a 20 minute power test. I'm a little nervous about that Last time didn't go so good. But after seeing my doctor 
last week and talking about possibly what I might have. Still waiting on test results, but the diet changes they that my doctor said would be beneficial, I've started incorporating that since Friday. And I'll be honest, it's been interesting. HRV is up, resting heart rate is down. I mean, that can also be because I'm taking rest and time off the bike. But I'm starting to hit numbers I haven't seen in a while. The other thing is, well, I will know more on Saturday when I do a 20 minute power test on how my stomach reacts. So it's all kind of a big hypothesis right now until I do some more testing. It's kind of a chilly one today. Yes, we got snow a couple of days ago. I think it was Monday, rest, first rest day. It actually worked out nicely. I was like, oh, thank goodness I don't have to ride today. I hate to ride inside. So it's, uh, it's a bit chilly though, but it's more the wind. The wind is making it feel like negative. Actually, not that. What am I saying? The wind is making it feel like 27 degrees. Not negative 27. Idiot. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't mind this. It looks kind of cool. Like it's not on the road, it's not messy. So, that snow, it can stay. <laughs> like I make the rules. It's a new day. New day here. Yesterday I was good. Uh, I had camera issues post ride. My microphone died on my camera. Anyways, it was going to be crappy quality. So uh, today, plan for today is we're going to kind of open the legs a little bit with uh, 60 minutes of tempo work. So like I said, I'm on that rest week, adapting this week, but I took Monday, Tuesday completely off the bike. Yesterday was just a chill two hour endurance ride, nothing serious. Um, felt amazing. Power was like 215. Today, uh, yeah, 60 minute tempo with surges. I'm gonna go for about three and a half hours. Tomorrow will be an easy rest day. And then Saturday we get after it with a 20 minute test and whatnot, but it's cold. Gosh, it's cold today. We'll see how it goes. All right, we finished our tempo effort. Went super good. Uh, yeah, I mean, I really don't have any complaints. Actually, it went better than I thought it would. Usually when I come off rest weeks, um, or I'm in the middle of one and I, my first couple efforts, even if it's at tempo, I tend to get stomach issues and just don't feel good. But, uh, like I said, I've been experimenting with the new diet. I'll tell you what that is in a couple of days, but I'm experimenting, experimenting with that. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. Today was good. I had like slight stomach issues at the very end, but even then they were pretty mild and sustainable. Um, I don't know. I think I did at least 300 watts for 60 minutes. I wasn't really watching average power. It, well, I was lapping each segment. It was like four, four and a half on, 30 higher, and then four and a half on, then 30 higher. And so I don't know what I did for an hour, but I think I did 300 watts, which is around par what, what I've been doing. So no complaints there. Um, yeah. I'm kind of cold though, sweated a little bit too much in this jacket. But other than that, just under two hours left, just endurance riding, and then I'm home. Ooh, that was a good one. Good ride today. So you can, you can tell when your legs are not fully opened up after a rest week. Like the tempo went really good. The endurance is going really good, but the last maybe 45 minutes or so, like the legs started to get achy. And that just kind of tells me like, things just aren't, things just aren't fully opened up and everything. And it's fine, I'm not worried about it. I mean, today's ride, if anything, probably opened them up nicely. So tomorrow I'll do a recovery spin. And then I'll get after it with my power test on Saturday. So next video will be about my 20 minute test on Saturday. Hopefully that goes a lot better this time. We shall see. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next one. You can go now. It's totally fine.